Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We're back today with another video. I know I haven't uploaded in the past few days. I've been busy with work, but we're back. And this video was recommended a few weeks ago when Charlie XCX released her latest song. Her latest song was New Shapes and it was with Christine and the Queens and Caroline Pochetic or something. I'm not sure how to pronounce her surname, but Caroline was on the track. So go check out my reaction to that song. Someone commented on that saying that there was a song that Charlie had with them before. So it's titled Gone and it has a music video and that's what we're reacting to today. Before we get into it guys, subscribe down below. We're hitting 1k soon. We're almost at 1000 subscribers. Subscribe and join the community. Help me out. Let me reach that goal. Subscribe down below, like this video and turn notifications on. And we'll just get on into this video. As I've said, this song is called Gone. It's got a music video, it's just over four minutes, and it's with Christine and the Queens. It's almost a 10 million views. It's two years old. I've never heard of it. I've never listened to the song. I've never listened to Christine and the Queens until I heard New Shapes a few weeks ago. So this is another introduction to them, and let's just dive on in. Okay, that beat is very heavy. I have to go. Okay, Charlie is looking snatched. I love the chains around her neck. Oh my god, she's tied to a car. I like this heavy production. They're both stunning. Oh, that pop in the production, that little pop that... I don't know how to describe it, but it was like bubblegum pop like sound in the background. I love that. And I'm just going to address both of them with the matching makeup, the matching looks, just stunning. Absolutely fantastic so far. I love Charlie XX and their vocals is so, so good. Oh, that beat drop. This is another one that I can sense just hearing in a club. Back in 2019, just vibing out to this. Oh, both of them are tied to the car. Their vocals together are so, so good. I love these high notes coming through. Okay, Christine and the Queens. There's graspiness in their voice, but it's very soothing to listen to. Are we gonna get choreo? They're interacting with each other, very contemporary dance-like. The emotion in their face is coming through so, so well. The rain. I did not expect that rain to come in. And we're getting a little bit of dancing, a little bit of choreo. Okay, it's slow and down and we've got some fire. Oh my god. I need to pause it. I know I paused it in the middle of that production, but that high note, the I'm speechless. That high note that came in from both of them, I wasn't expecting it. The bridge was very mellow, very slow, stripped back, and then just ended with that. And now the production is picking up again. I'm blown away by this. It's very electronic-like, very synth. A little bit EDM, a little bit heavy. And they're just having fun. I love the distortion in these vo this voice. Oh, I love this auto tune. And that's it coming to an end now. Just fading out this repetition with a little bit of auto tune, a little bit of graspiness. Wow. I love that music video. It was very basic, but there was sharpness to it. There was the rain, there was the fire, there was the dramatic scene of the car tied to the car. It was very dramatic and very sharp. But it, it was simplistic, it was very stripped back. Their vocals came through, both of them cohesively, 
went really, really well. Love, love their voices together. Charlie XX is someone that I'm gravitating more and more and more to. I listen to them a lot at work. I'm trying to avoid a lot of her songs simply because I want to react to them, like the Vroom Vroom EP, Pop 2, I think that's a mixtape. I know Fanbot is on one, I've done Vroom Vroom, so only one on each that I've reacted to. They're on my channel, go check them out, but I want to listen to the rest of them. So guys, if you want me to react to those two EPs or mixtapes, let me know down below. Let me know and like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and turn notifications on too. I'm going to rate this song... I think I'll rate it 8 out of 10. I had to think about it for a minute. 8 out of 10 simply because near the end it was a little bit too repetitive, but still liked it and content wise, don't know what it was about. I was so took back by the production, the vocals, the visuals that I'm going to go have to listen to this again just to take in the meaning and the lyrics just to see what it's about. But 8 out of 10 for my first listen. Let me know what you guys think down below and don't forget to follow all my social media. They're all down below as well. My Instagram, my Twitter and my TikTok. My Instagram's on the screen. Follow it and follow them all down below and I'll see you in the next video.